Hi uh, and welcome. I hope you are good. Uh, this video is about how to fetch the first row of each group uh, using pandas. Now, uh, first I'll import the libraries NumPy and pandas. And now I'm just creating a scenario where I'll create a dummy data frame to show what I'm going to do. So the dummy data frame looks something like this. So we have year sales and profit. Now your data frame uh, would might look different, but, uh, but but here I'm just explaining the logic, uh, how to extract the rows. Now in this case, to just tell you about this data, now there are four rows for each of the year. So as you can see, so basically we can say that we have uh, observation for each quarter of the year. So for 2019, there are four rows. Then 2018, again, there are four rows. And 2017, there are again four rows. Now the objective is, to fetch the first row for each of the year. So uh, we want to fetch uh, the first row of 2019, which is this one, then uh, the first row of 2018, and then the first row of 2017. Now there are multiple methods of doing this. I'll, I'll tell you three of the methods which I use uh, to fetch uh, the data in this format. So the first method is to use using group by method and the head method in pandas. So what we'll do is uh, we'll take first the data frame which is df. df. I'll just uh, zoom in a, a bit. Okay, so df dot, we need to group by on the group. So in our case, the group here is year. Now it could be any other category in, in, uh, in your data frame from which you want to fetch the data. So group by in quotes year, and then we just need to put in head H E A D and one. So this will fetch the first row of each of the group year. Okay, so as I, as I said, uh, the first row of 2019 is this one, as we, as we can verify. And then for 2018, it's 2,300,876, which is this one. This is the first row again in 2018. And then for 2017, 7230 and 549. So this fetches the first uh, first row of each of the group. Now in case you want the first two rows, so we just need to put in two here. So this will fetch the first two rows. So this is my personal favorite uh, in case I want to fetch in the first row of each of the group. Now another method is we use the group by and the first method FIRST first. So how will we do that? Again, df dot group by then year dot first. Okay. So again, uh, this is first this you know, fetched in the. I'll just. Uh, comment this one just to check so as we can see they are both uh, returning the same data frame but in, but in this case in the case of first the, the data is sorted on the year so and the year will be in the index in the index not it will not be a column in the data frame in case you want it in the data frame we just need to reset underscore index we don't need to drop anything okay so again this is fetching the same data now this is the second method another method which is also uh, now now this method is not generalized i don't think there is second in the data frame no okay there is only first okay now head is more generalized method another method uh, to fetch the um, the first or any other row any other row in a group is using the group by 
and the nth method. So what we do is df dot group by again here the group by part is same then nth. Now in nth it starts with zero as the numbering in uh, the index in uh, uh, pandas or in Python starts with, with zero. So here we need to give zero if we want if we want the first. Okay, so again this uh, uh, returns the data frame and the year is again sorted in the uh, in the ascending order. So this returns the nth. Now this is more generalized method in case you want the second one, not the first and the second, the second one. So we just need to put in one. So as you can see, this is. Uh, 5600, zero, zero. I'll just verify a, it with 2017. 5600, zero, zero. this is the second one. Then 2018, 2018, it's 1400 zero, zero, and 352. So 1400, zero, zero, 352. And for 2019, it's 6000 and 456. This one. Okay. So most of the time, I end up using the head method because, uh, like, you can use anyone but uh, I end up using this one more than any other method. So, and one more thing that uh, in this case, it doesn't return the, the, the group by variable in a, in, as an index, but it return it as a one of the columns in the data frame. So I'll just summarize everything. Okay. So the first method is this one, df.groupby.head1. The second method is, I'm not putting the reset right now. So group by first and the third method is to use the nth. So I'm just putting in the, the first that is nth zero. Okay. So these are the four methods using which you can fetch the first row of each of the group using the pandas library in python so i'll be creating a similar video in r if you are working in r so uh, for for now uh, that is what i have and uh, i hope it it was useful and take care thank you